Hello, Yellow Hobo here, and we're playing Going Medieval. This is what we're starting off with. Eric Holland, Tiffany Woods, and Gotha Beck. We're going to go over their skills just a little bit. I've tweaked with some of their skills just to make this look a little bit prettier because some of them were pretty amazing at some things and not so great at the others. Our least amount of trade is tailoring, so we're going to have to work on that. But Edric is going to be Willful Farmer and the Dr. Snoodlegarth. And they, I fixed all their alignments on their religion, so they're all devout restitutionists. And then this is just the perks he came with, so he's benevolent, so he's getting good speechcraft there. He's outgoing, infirm, which is, I mean, it's okay. Ill-favored. Which takes away from speech craft and also an iron stomach, which is going to help out in the future. Over here, looking at Tiffania, Tiffania Woods. These are all random generated names. I just picked the ones that sound the best. She's a pentinet, which is for carpentry, architect, which is great for our construction, and the hanged of ember. And then on top of that, she's winsome, so more speech craft. And she's got a passion for speech craft. Kind of kept her the same and but we did add marksman she was into i think medicine or something like that i didn't really like that one gotitha she's bloodthirsty healer <laughs> the hanged of karn and then she's also lord of misrule punch drunk so don't get her drunk and then gobbler and on top of that brawler which takes away from her speechcraft which she has super high speechcraft don't know if I want to keep all those points, but I think I am. So let's go ahead and jump into the game itself. I guess I'll show you this real quick. We've actually put our banner in here, so I thought that was a pretty cool thing to actually add. But we're playing a standard normal, new life, and valley. And we're probably going to play with tutorial on, but you're not going to see that. So we're going to go ahead and pause this up and get some storage areas placed down. Now, I gotta remember where everything is. I think it's this. Zone, yeah. Default stockpile zone. Let's go ahead and scroll out a little bit and see what we got going on. Okay. Pretty base, pretty flat. We do have resources pretty close by, though. So, I think our best bet would be probably moving our stockpile over here and probably initially getting everything built like that so can I just no not you is it F yeah there you go and everybody can start getting to work production I'm gonna get a campfire going over here I forgot this game has some amazing grid systems, so that's going to help me out because I am very, very random whenever I build. So we got the base. We're not ready for the base yet, so we're just going to keep on going on. And here's all of our chopping orders. That's kind of what I wanted to do there. We'll just chop a couple of these things down, and then we're going to also hit this grass. There you go. Forbidden allow. Yep. <sighs> Figured there was a thing about that. I don't want to do too much with the, everything in that regards. So we can go ahead and grab a couple of these clay piles too. And dirt pile. Oh, there's a dead deer there. Is it, is it good still? I think it's still good. This game is so smooth, man. I'm, I'm not used to this. Getting a basic research table up. We're getting troughs filled up as well. We got food for the... Yeah, we got hay piles already. I'm pretty sure that's what they eat. So it shouldn't be too hardcore. Okay. I guess I'll read this real quick. So sometimes whenever they cut these down, they mishandle it and don't get timber. That's kind of harsh, but I like it. <laughs> So we just unlocked agriculture, and then we got Edric over here doing some more research for us. So I'm thinking it's zones. Yeah, cabbage field. We need to go ahead and get this place, like, quick, fast, and in a hurry. So we're going to put it, I'd say, right about 
here and see how much we get off this. Not enough seed. Okay, we got... We'll get 35 going. That should be good. And he's botanist too, so he's going to stop research to go plant. So we're building a uh, building on top of our stockpile first before we get them anything going. Which I probably need to get like a hay sleeping spot or something and just plop them down. Well, can I just cancel and then I need to make a new one. I wish I could just double click and move, but wishes are uh, not always granted. <laughs> We're getting this planted up too, though, which is really nice. So, uh, tried prioritizing up these beds. Hopefully, they take this uh, seriously. Won't clear the area. Crap. Well, hopefully, she clears the area or something. We'll get two beds up at least. We got Edric prioritizing research, which is pretty good for us. So, we're about to get our third sleeping spot down. I don't know if I need to prioritize. Okay, we do. So, you got a bed. You got a bed. I wish it wouldn't let me... Or tell me that it had the bed... Uh, or the person had a bed already. Just make it a little easier, you know? Oh, we're finally getting the roof on. I turned the speed up just a little bit to get it done and get through the night as well. So we finally got this little house done up. I wonder if we can move these beds whenever... Copy, relocate, okay. So we can relocate. So this is a spare room now. And we shouldn't have any kind of, yeah, modest spare room, cool. We're gonna get these all nice and done up and we're getting more berries just so we can have food. And our next thing will be, oh, well, you got a botanic skill too. Our next thing will be getting up uh, actual housing for everybody. I think I'll do small houses like this to make them happy because it's modest size and we got a table, like a dining room already, so that's pretty cool. We just need to get it enclosed. Yeah, it is. So we adjusted some of their jobs and they're actually running a little bit more efficient now. Like we got Godetha just hauling all day long because we need to get everything inside. Okay, we can take some iron nuggets. And it seems like we have iron right here. Do we dig into the ground for it, though? Seems like a bit of a run for that. Clay piles, not too bothered about that. We have clay pretty much all around us. Limestone. We're going to pick up one limestone just in case we need it. We're starting to mine now, and she's happy about it. I wonder if there's anywhere I can actually hunt, because I haven't seen any wildlife. Ah, there's a deer female. Is there anything else around here? Forbidden even. We'll grab that bad boy. And we can hunt a fox too. I don't know what we get from it. We have a hunter. So let's see what happens. Is that a whole pile of them? Oh, it's just more iron. Iron nuggets. Our little stockpile's getting a little full now, huh? Oh, we got that fox. I didn't even see it happen. Dang it. Man, it is raining hard here. We got some puddles and everything. How do you like this? Nice and chill. Ooh, Edric and Goddess are friends. Man, he's making friends with everybody. He needs more sleep. Dang. Well rest is 90% confident and he's almost to the tired, if not exhausted. We need to not let them sleep in the rain anymore. A little tired, comfortable. Minus two. Alright, so we might need some entertainment of some sort. Okay, we can do the restitutionist and a backgammon table. We're going to do that, like, kind of close to the beds, but not where we're going to be, like, in there whenever I start building it. Just working as lumberjacks right now. She got a botany skill from cutting down a tree? 
Huh. I'll tell you what, though. They do cut down trees pretty quick. Ah. Come on. We need the wood, brother. Can't be mishandling. We're training the goat. Hey, it was a success. I don't know what that means. Oh, okay. 13%. Perfect. Maybe we need to keep on training him? Okay. So you can only train them once a day. So we need to train all the little goats. And maybe even the cat. Is it going to be successful again? Nah, dang. Alright, cat, come here. Nope, nope. <laughs> Can't train the cat. About to have some entertainment up. Oh no, it's a merchant stall. Dang it. Tefania, don't mess this up. It's been taking you a second to build this thing. There we go. Doing some more red current pies. Or piles. We're getting some more red current. Okay. Initiate bartering. So we got the merchant stall up. Here's our merchant here. Pretty cool. Now I can't. Oh, come on now. We gotta use Tefania. She's got the she's got the skill base to make it better. Man, that fox sells for freaking twenty one bucks. I think we're gonna do that and then probably pick up some seeds. Ooh, deer carcass. But I don't know if I can kill a deer easy. We haven't killed one. You just picked them up off the ground. Kind of like on Sapiens, you find a dead mammoth and <laughs> it's it's pretty pretty easy. Oh, we got thirty eight. Nah, it's probably total is what we have at 38. But we need seeds. They got seven beet seeds. Let's go ahead and barter this over for it. Now we still got some money to play with. Dubious booze. Okay, I don't, I don't think it's, uh, I think it's worth there. They got a hair carcass, or we have a hair carcass. I don't know where we got that one from. And let's see, we have a bow we're not using, but might as well hang on to it until we get there. Huh. Mechanical capote. I'm going to say we probably need that. The cat's even worth 13 bucks. Nope. So we, what you're telling me is we, sh we should probably start breeding, right? We should start breeding our goats and stuff. We got a male and a female. Uh, pheasant carcass... I wonder if they can just give us gold. Is that a is that a thing, or we just gotta barter barter away? Got animal feed too. Hmm. Could get barley, but I don't have anything to do with it yet. I guess we can get the. That's eh, closer. So minus thirty. Okay, so it's still in our favor-ish, or in their favor, so it should be okay. Anything else? Okay. Herbs. Uh, it might be good for, like, healing. Yeah, it says medicine. Mm. I'm going to say probably. So, we don't really need the cabbage seeds. Because we got a, we got a good bit of cabbage being made right now, and we can get one herb. <laughs> we could trade a deer, but I, food, food-wise, I don't feel comfortable trading the deer. Package meals, no. Nope. And accept. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, we'll be all right there. Three hundred thirty-three, or three hundred thirty-eight XP. Didn't even give us the level. Crap. So we got backgammon made, and we got the, uh... This should make people happy, right? She just had a sad face, so... Oh, she's sleeping outside now. Now we need to build a house, is what it's telling me. And we got this built up. It's it's my version of a kill box. Don't judge. <laughs> I figured we're gonna get raided, so might as well get something. And... This is something I can throw them inside. And hopefully these traps will take care of business for a couple of fights. We have two houses crafted up right now. We'll see if it's enough to build everything, but... 
And it says research available. It's not the research I want yet. Uh, probably going to go into terraforming or any of the specializations like stone block cutting or to even defensive structure, smelting cartography, which I don't know if that's going to be even worth, but it, it, might, it probably is. I mean, let's, let's be honest. Wooden weaponry might be worth as well. Okay, so first person coming and I realized that I was, uh, I had built this wrong. So we're going to try to fix our mistake here because these are for archers and archers are not going to, like they're just able to hopscotch the wall, which, uh, as you can guess, is probably not the best for us right now. And we should be getting... Ooh, got us this birthday. Oh, man. I forgot to put a bed down. Crap. He's sleeping inside, though. Tefania is working like a mad woman right now, trying to get these walls up. Which is just going to save us big time. And luckily, we deconstructed the, the purlons or merlons. And they use a lot more wood than the walls themselves. So, yeah. We're going to have an excess of wood after this, too. Should be able to build the houses as well. This one's basically built. We tended Hank in. Uh, hopefully, he's good to go after this. Hopefully, oh, he's melee. Well, that's not the best. Oh, he's got marksman, too, so that's okay. So, the thing is, we got to find our bow. Or we can just do manage. Yeah. Hankin, you, good buddy, are going to take a ranged weapon. And hopefully he picks it up. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. And you can sleep it off. And we're getting our first harvest, too. Look at that, man. Woo-wee. Seeing 184 cabbages. That's not too bad. All right, so looks like we're uh, getting raided. And tutorial. They're still just hanging out. I don't know if they're going to come here yet. They're pretty close. Now I wish that they would build this stuff, but they're just not doing it. Hank and you two, come, come build some of this stuff. You'd clear the wood, be all right. Let everybody get nice and filled up. Oh, we didn't get a wall right there, anyways. All right, raid started. So we should be pretty good. We're just gonna stand right here and let them funnel through some of those traps. And hopefully those archers cannot hit me, like, instantly. Alright, cool. They hit some of the stuff. Alright, so, first things first, Gothitha. Go ahead and attack that person that's running. And then we're gonna go, like, you there, you right here. And Edric, you're gonna go over here and attack the guy that got hit already. Ooh, that was a good hit. As long as there's no friendly fire, that'd be alright. Edric, don't get hit. Don't get hit in the back. Victory. Keep on going. Keep that person. Everybody attack him. Yeah. That's what we're talking about. I guess we can just do this. R. There you go. F. And grab all that. Not too bad on the first raid. We only got one stick trap that went off because we didn't have our wall yet. But that's going to change eventually. We do have a lot more armor now. It didn't do them any good, but it might do us a little better. 
That's a cool looking flail. Ooh. I don't know, the spear hit pretty hard, but Edric's got pretty good melee and Goddeth has got really good me melee too. We barely took a scratch there. So we're trying to tame a wolf. We'll, we'll see what happens. Oh, nice. It says tame 0% though. Well, dang. Eventually we'll get it tamed, right? Oh, we got taming attempts remaining today, though. Oh. Well, it said one. So we got 615 wood down, and that's not even counting all the other wood that's down, too. I'm gonna say we're probably good for wood now. I don't know where the stuff went underneath here. I don't know if we finally moved it. I'm putting a floor on this, and I'm gonna remove the roof. And it should count as a room still. And then we're going to put stairs so I can go from the outside up. We just got some milk from our goat. Perfect. So hopefully we can get them trained up to still trying to get that wolf tamed. They're slowly getting this house built up too. Got the wood on it and the hay on most of the roof. So it should be coming together pretty soon. Someone might get it tonight. Oh, come on, Hankin. He actually came with pretty good skills, too. I mean, his construction 17. We kind of needed a better construction person, but, I mean, Tifania has been doing pretty good. Look at this helmet she threw on. you you carrying a bow. You got this bad A-looking helmet. She put on some kind of crown. It's <laughs> pretty cool. Inventory. Gamson. Crown. Flimsy. Needs to be uh, probably fixed up. You didn't put no hat on now. We got this wolf 42% tamed as well. It's not too bad. And we had a little baby called Esta. Cool, look at that. Little baby goat. Got to start getting this one uh, or trained up too. Might as well start them young. So we got these stairs built. Now we just need to get the rest of this on the inside built up as well. Only thing that's a little concerning is there's a piece of the floor missing and I don't know if I need to like... Can't place it. Okay, so we need to put a wooden beam in. And I need to figure out how to get down a level in the building. Which I'm sure there is some way to do it. Yeah, I just had to strip away the layers. So that's not too bad. We're just gonna have to probably lose a spot or two. Needs to be placed between two walls or ground. Okay. So we need to put a wall. Oh, come on now. It seemed like it was going to work. It's probably because there's this, this thing underneath. We'll see if we, once we get these walls up, if it'll work for us. So we got these pyres set up, so we're gonna start setting these bodies on fire, cause uh, kind of a bad deal for us. So we had to build a Oak Brethren Shrine for Hankin, since he is Oak Brethren barely, but he's, he's an Oak Brethren. Man, we've been going negative on this wolf. No fun. Ooh, it's summer now. Now is the time to build underground storage to keep food fresh in sunny days to come. Okay. Well, we kind of need one more point in research. I, th I think it's one point to terraform. No, nope, we need quite a bit more points. Dang. Well, we're going to need somebody else to do the job like that. Got all this wood. I'm not putting anywhere though. Hmm. Still trying to get this wolf tamed up. Still filling. And 11% now. Seems like training them when they're younger actually works out better for us. We'll have to keep on looking into that though. Edric's doing his due diligence. Desperately thirsty. 
Brew some alcoholic beverages for your settlers. Man, I don't have no alcohol beverages for my settlers. I did a long time ago. I don't see that keg in here anymore. No we need we need someone to come trade. We could pick up fermenting. Uh, fermentation from vinegar to alcohol and cheese production. You know what? We're going to do this. Kind of has to do that. And we're going to have stuff rotting here pretty soon. I don't know why I keep on pushing B. But the fermentation station. You got people hungry somehow. I don't know how you're hungry. It's like anything work. Uh, you know what? We're gonna do leisure for two hours and then work. Uh, no. It'll be something like this. Uh, nope, copy, paste. Pace, pace. There you go. Easy. Kind of looking like a little fort going on now. With a random house <laughs> off to the side. But this will be housed eventually just for... Just for having a kitchen area. Getting the fermenting station built up. Man, Tafanian's already at 20 construction now. Oh, you failed. Sano again. We'll see what we can do with this, too. Come on. Take quite a bit of time to build that up, huh? Curdling milk. Fermenting fruit juice. What does it take? 20 alcohol ingredients. Does this make... I'm saying this probably makes it. And eventually we'll be able to do that. We're going to do this until we have 10, until we have 10, and until we have 10. Just to make it nice and easy for us. Does that look nice now? I know it's a storage area, but we can fight from here. Which is pretty cool. They're finally fermenting. Ah. Oh. Come on. <sighs> Dang. We need to see which one which which it is, which one it does for that. I don't even know how to talk right now. Dang it. Is it craft? Butchering table, stonemason bench, kiln, box, apothecary bench. Okay. So, and he's got a really high. What about you, Hankin? You know what? There. We're gonna go ahead and get a beet field going now. We can't make a big one. Yeah, so. We got seven seeds. I just wish I could put like one more. There you go. That should work out pretty good. We got barley, herbs. Red currant, birch tree. You know what? We're gonna plant these kind of close. We got a, quite a bit of seeds. Not surprising, <laughs> considering we could chop down on quite a bit of trees. Maple sapling one. See how many I can make of this. So I've cut down quite a bit of maples. What of it? <laughs> uh oh. Nothing. You ain't running for nobody? You got good botany. I'll take you. Scott's Pond. Okay, we got we got quite a bit of stuff going on now. We can get some herbs going too. 
Not a lot of herbs, but we can get some. Well, Tanya's not our doctor, but she went and healed that person anyways. So, perfect one there. Man, these trees are getting planted pretty quick. Probably takes a while for them to grow, though. 15 days, oof. Settler wounds need tending. Who got hurt? I mean, he's fine now. What did he get hurt by? Trap? Maybe? Uh, it doesn't tell me. I'm gonna say that he's alright. Hopefully they start getting rid of this vegetable rot pile. I made a place for it. Oh, no, they're they're taking the deer carcass and stuff. Great. I thought this would be for rot, but... I just want waste here, not, not stuff that's still good. Our goat died finally. Probably from old age, huh? Good way to get your botany skill up here, that's for sure. Hankins finally went over to the restitutionist side. That's funny. I guess because everybody else worships it, he finally was like, okay. Dang, we don't even have enough skill to do the beats yet. We just gotta keep on getting our botany up and hopefully we'll get it eventually. Somehow we got some of these beats. Do we have someone with botany 20? Oh, Dulcia does have botany 20. Goditha's 18. Okay, at least we got one person that can actually plant it. Oh my gosh, a dog arrived somewhere. Hold up. Can we tame it? Oh, it's domestic. Well, let's train it. Oh, so the cartography table is useful because then you can see the... Ah, that makes sense. We need to get the research station up <laughs> so we can start generating red points as well. So let's go ahead and get that going. Research table. Just put this right next to this. Hopefully they can still access... Uh, you know what? Let's just uh, copy this and put it like right there and then just cancel that one. That way we don't have any clipping problems. We're just going to focus on making books as fast as possible. So hopefully that'll help us out in the long run. Uh oh, so clothes go bad after a while. Uh, we're going to have to fix that. <laughs> <laughs> for sure. Kind of hoping for an attack here pretty soon. It's been a long time. We got a cattle? Doesn't even have a husbandry number. That is a long ways to lock though. Holy cow. Tefania just got a 68% on that bad boy. Alright, so we are pumping out some chronicles now. I built two more tables so everybody could get on it. So our thing is, what do we want to make next? Do we want to wait to get the 30? And then this will bring in caravans so we can trade. Because everybody's thirsty. And yeah, desperately thirsty. And I, I just can't make drinks right now. So our main thing is, do I want to, like, try to rush into drinks? Because we got ice making right here. Maybe that'll give us something. No, it just generates ice. And we got preserving food and rug making. I don't see anything that'll let me make a drink in the earlier tiers. So I say we get the 30 for cartography, then we're going to go into tailoring. All right, so let's go ahead and get our cartography now. And we'll get that built up in the morning. Ooh, we got more furniture. Okay, cartography table, we'll do that there. 
and caravan halt, I guess, right around here. Okay, so we got a cow finally. I'm gonna train it up. We got dubious booze from fermented mash. I guess that's how you make your alcohol. We'll see if uh, people. Are you thirsty? No, you're still in ugly apparel. Yeah, we gotta get tailoring going. Hopefully, with this being built, this will help me out. We unlocked the region map. Woo! Okay, so we got a couple of different factions that are okay with me, but we got people that are not okay with me. The Lipsters are all right with me. Church of Restitution, that's why. Huh. Okay, we can send a... We got a region influence, which isn't very big. We could send a caravan, but not right yet. Oh gosh, we got a heat wave going on. Oh, they're drinking dubious booze. Finally. Why are they working right now? Didn't I just tell them? Yeah, they should be doing leisure. Not not that. We can start beekeeping, maybe? Ah, man. To do that or wait for tailoring? Yeah, we're gonna wait for tailoring. We're so close. This dang heat wave's killing me. It is hot out here, all right? Is it hot over here? Oof. Dude, it's only six o'clock and it's this hot. Holy cow. We need to uh, probably move inside, huh? Not enough seeds to sow filled. Oh man. We're just going to tough it out. If people go down, I don't, I don't know what's going to happen. If they pass out. <laughs> Sweaty. Night terror. I don't... I really don't know what to tell you on that one, buddy. My food reserves are low. I'm letting these ripen. We could get more of that. Or we can hunt. We might have to hunt in this awful heat. Uh, where are the deer? Unless they all died or ran away. There's two right there. We can try to... This is Butcher Forever, not our resources. And... I guess we need more. That'll be whenever we get uh, good old meat, though. Which someone's working on it now. Hankin, he likes hunting anyways. Tefania ran away. Oh, okay. Never mind. They're not running away. The deer are running away. Come on. All right, we got that one. We got a dearly departed achievement. Cool. I wonder if I sent them on a caravan, if it would get them not so hot. <laughs> uh, tailoring. And we need to build a building to put all this stuff inside. And I think I'm going to put it over here. Finally, heat waves ended. Uh, sewing station. Yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and get a building set up over here. Flooring. It's gonna be a big, big building. Not two stories though, it's just gonna be one big old building. Ooh, nice. Is that going to cut off? No, okay. Also, if my stuff is not even, um, sorry. <laughs> but that's going to happen. It's always going to happen. Let's, let's see if I can get a roof on here. 
without having to... No. Okay. So we're going to need... Unless I can do it this way. Ooh. No. So we can go 12 by 15. So we need something to support in the middle. Um, how about we cancel that and see if I can put this here now. What about it? We're going to do this and see if it'll place it. Ah. Do you see it snap there? Awesome. I figured it out. So do I even need this wall? No, I don't. Cool. I've only been playing for like, what? Two hours and 36 minutes, finally figured it out. Now can I place the roof? All right, let's see what I can get going here then. That doesn't look very promising to me. Unless I need a, well, I have a strut there. All right, pause for a second. We gotta, we gotta fix what's going on here. Uh, just singly do this. So do I need like a wall that runs in between these? I want to say probably. Even though we got it. Unless. Come on. Just brace it. Brace the whole building off these. And can I do something like... I don't know. Some, somewhere around here instead? No. It's only let me put... certain spots. See, that works. All right, let's see if it'll work now since I deleted that one. No. Well, crud, man. Maybe I need... Hmm. Maybe I need a wall right here. And hopefully it'll let me put it there. It's a bunch of theory crafting right now going on. It's crazy, I know, right? Oh my gosh, it finally let me do it. Yes, we can get a roof on this bad boy. Wait a tick. That's not right. Alright. Uh, why? Why? Come on now. We're gonna get it. I'm letting you know right now. All right, is that is that good? Is it all closed? Perfect. 
Uh, scent of spices on the breeze preceded the arrival of merchant caravan living. Oh, nice. Maybe I can sell some stuff and some things. So we're going to go ahead and barter with Osman and see what we can get. They got a lot of nice things. <laughs> and clay bricks sell for a good bit. Hmm. You can't have my dog. We just got that bad boy. Healing kit seems good. What's a kerchief do? Okay, cool. They're getting leathers off their stuff. Do I have leathers? Yes, I do. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Duh. Yeah, that's, that's my leather. Gotcha. They got fine light armor and a fox pelt. Ooh. Ooh, these things sell for a lot too. Holy cow, we we need uh we we need to get get in that game. Uh, you got any seeds, or are you just like a warring people? Hmm. Ah, winter clothes, sturdy. We'll hold on to the clothes we got. Um, do I have anything to actually sell them? These textbooks sell for a lot. I don't want to sell them because they take quite a bit to actually make. We got 97 meat. I guess deers do give a, quite a bit of meat, so that makes sense. We could sell you some of these iron nuggets, but they're not worth a whole lot, and I don't want to do that. Shoo wee. You're selling these for 10, only buy them for 4. No thanks. I don't really see anything. Uh, chest iron. What's chest good for? We got stockpiles. We don't need no chest. We could get carrots. Not a bad idea. Hmm. Yeah. You can sell a basic research table? How do you... You just like build it and then pack it up. I don't even know. You can get a donkey? Oh man. Is this a fully trained donkey? No, it's not even tamed. Well, let's see here. I say, well, look at the cow price too. We need to get some of that. I don't I don't see really anything to sell. We could buy some chronicles from them, but I'm not really feeling that. And I don't really have anything to sell. I don't have any carcasses or nothing that are really worth. I sell them. Uh, nah. Because once we get the tailoring up, I feel like leather workings may be implement implemented in that. And we're just not ready for that yet. So, I'm going to have to decline. We can get beekeeping up too now. I think that'll be something we spend our first red books on. We need wood. We're getting close with our farm to actually get it. Uh, where do we want to put this at? A skip. Put bees right where we're going to eat at. Yeah, perfect. Oh, it's autumn. Now I think it's time to one, probably... Well, Wolf, you're not hungry because you just came in and ate my food. But I think it's a good time to wrap it up on the video. I hope you enjoyed watching. We're going to continue to play this. I played it a while back and got some achievements unlocked, but I had to relearn this whole game. So thanks for sticking with me. If you think I deserve it, give me a like, give me a subscribe. I'll see you on the next one, everybody. Have a great day, and goodbye.